Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Serge Pools here, back with another video. And before you back out, give me a chance. I'm gonna do a pack battle. Well, not really a pack battle, just a pack opening of my two favorite products. And I kind of want to see which one gives me the uh, the best pulls. If you guys don't know, Dahmer's Optic is newer. It's been on fire. These packs are fire. You can pull downtowns. You can pull a lot of heat out of those. And Prism, Prism's a little bit older. Came out what, a few months ago now. But this pack was same thing. It was on fire. Everyone was going crazy for them. They were sold out and stuff like that. But let's see. I don't know. This is the older one. This is the newer one. These are both, in my opinion, the best two products of the year. And I just want to open them up. I have, I've had fun opening up both of these products. So let's get right into it. Let's dissect it. Let's see our odds and what comes inside these boxes. So really quick. Right here, I have a Walmart version of Donner's Optic. It says, find three blaster exclusive rated rookie purple shock parallels. And it says, look for blaster exclusive blue hyper memorabilia cards and look for the ultra rare downtown inserts. So hopefully we can pull downtown in today's video. And right here for Prism, 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 Prism. I don't even know where to start. It says, find five blaster exclusive red, white, and blue Prisms per box on average. And it says also look for blaster exclusive memorabilia cards. Find one silver prism per box on average. And as far as I'm concerned, I'm not sure what the big case hit out of these are. I'm not even sure if they have a case hit. But I know you can pull autos, you can pull low, low number cards. And yeah, some pretty good stuff comes out of these. So let's go. The top two going head to head. It's like Mike Tyson. And I don't even know someone else all right let's get right into it we're gonna start off with the prism first we're gonna start off with the prism I swear I love these Walmart ones love the way they look all right here we go starting off with prism I haven't opened one of these in I don't even know how long at least a month but here, here's our six packs let's get right into it hopefully we can pull some heat let's see who comes out on top right now drop a like i mean drop a comment which one you think is going to get the best pull donruss optic or prism i want to know what you guys think here we go damn prism 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 Whew, i forgot how they look justin simmons alvin kamara already we get a silver variation um, Hassan Haskins for the Titans rookie. These are pretty cool. And a Marquise Brown on a red, white, and blue. All right. Let's see if we can hopefully get a numbered a numbered card or an auto out of this. That'd be pretty cool. Darnell Mooney, Marshall Falk, Juju Smith. And a Chris Olave, okay. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Buddha Baker, Shaquille Leonard, Brandon Ayuk, and a Brian Robinson Jr. I haven't seen this. I don't think I've seen this guy come out of Donner's Optic for me. I forgot about this guy. He's gonna be good next year. It's a nice little insert. We'll take that. And, and one thing about Prism too, Prism always holds its value, especially if it's a good player, a rookie card or an insert. Donovan McNabb and a Charles Cross. Okay, we'll take that. Two more. Come on, Prism, be good. All right, we got something back there. It looks like a hype. All right, let's go. Mark Andrews. Patrick Mahomes, Julian Love, and a Kyle Pitts, slightly bent. I'm not sure how much that affects the grade. Probably wouldn't even grade this, but nice looking card on the hype. We'll take that. All right. Last one, looks like nothing crazy. Michael Golip, Chris Carter, George Kalafis. We'll take this. I don't know why I've been saving all his cards I get. 
I have like a few numbered of his that I pulled. And um, yeah, I have his rookie, so all his inserts. I don't know, I have a feeling he's just gonna be one of those good linemen. Like, I hear a lot of good stuff about him, so you never know. You never know in the future. People may respect linemen and wanna go after the cards. Hassan Haskins to end it on the Prism. So not bad for Prism. Not too shabby. Definitely had worse. All right, here we go. With the Holy Grail, Donruss Optic. Honestly, like I said, these are both my favorite products of the year, but I had to go with Donruss Optic. It's just fire. And I honestly like the way the base cards look too. All right, I don't know if I'm tripping. We got something heavy. We for sure got something in here. All right, let's go. Donruss Optic, here we go. Come on, we need a downtown. I'm due for a downtown. James Cook will take that and a Jalen Tolbert. All right. Come on, we need a downtown or Kenny P something. Mike Evans, JC Horn, Red Hot Rookies, Chris Olave right out the back. We'll take that. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve this up. The edges are kind of rough on it. But hey, we'll take it. We'll take anything we could get. Sleeve this up. Red Hot Rookies. Card looks fire. And there's literal fire on the card as well. Greg Dolchik. Alright, so not too shabby. Got four packs left. Come on, we need a downtown. Come on. I'm due for a downtown. Or a Blazers at least. Condre Diggs, Zay Jones, Jamar Chase, second year silver. We'll take that. And a Jordan Davis on the Raider rookie. It's a nice looking card. Second year, Super Bowl, okay. Clean, clean. Oh, but thought we had something. I think we got another Jamar Chase. Oh, we got Joel Burrow on the Dominators. We'll take that. Who do we got behind it? Oh, Brian Cook. Okay. Joel Burrow, Dominators. We'll take that. All right. Not numbered. Brian Cook. These cards are so fire. And a Matt Corral. Funny story on Matt Corral. Um, I actually re recently got into breaks on whatnot. Like a few months ago. And my very first break... I got hooked because I pulled an RPA of Matt Corral. I mean, it, it wasn't nothing crazy, but it was RPA um, out of prison, I believe, yeah. And I was like, oh, let's go. And after that, I just kept buying into them. You win some, you lose some, but, ooh, Big Ben. But yeah, I was hyped pulling that card. We'll take a Big Ben, Amari Cooper. Bailey Zapp, I always pull this guy on the purple shock. I need a Kenny Pickett. <sighs> I'm just gonna have to buy it. Kyler Gordon. One Kenny Pickett card goes for like $40. So you pretty much make money if you pull a Kenny Pickett or a Brock Purdy. That's probably why they're so hard to pull. All right, so we definitely got something fat. I knew it was heavy. Damn, so it looks like no downtown. Another stealer, Alex Highsmith, okay. All right, not an auto. Donruss Threads. On the color match, too. That's pretty fire. Not from any specific game or event. Damn. So, who knows? It's not even a real jersey for all we know. All right, Gabe Davis. We'll take it. We'll take it. Not complaining. Not too shabby. And a silver Mac Jones and a Wando Robinson to end it. Damn. All right. So definitely Donruss Optic won that. But let's go ahead and do a quick little review. Prism. Prism's good. Just I don't think I think you just get more out of Donruss Optic. And you have a chance at a downtown. So 
Yeah. All right, we got a Son Haskins rookie, George Kalafis on the red, white, and blue. Kyle Pitts hype. Donovan McNabb, Charles Cross rookie. Brian Robinson, that's a nice card. Especially if he balls out. Got to sleeve that up soon. Chris Olave, Juju, Marquise Brown, and a Hassan Haskins on the... I honestly don't even know what you call this variation. I know it's not a silver. No ink variation. I don't know. But what I do know is that they should start really putting the name of the cards. Like this one, red, white, and blue. It's common sense, but maybe put it right there. So whoever doesn't know could easily like, like this one. I have no idea what this is called. I'm pretty sure I could figure it out, but I don't want to do all that. It should just be on the card. All right. And right here, Donruss Optic. Let's see what we got. James Cook. Card looks nice. Color match. Jalen Tolbert. Mac Jones. Wandell Robinson. Gabe Davis on the patch. Okay. Bailey Zapp. Kyler Gordon. Matt Corral. Brian Cook. Joel Burrow on the Dominators. Like a bunch of inserts in here. Jamar Chase on a silver second year. That's a fire card. Like. People may ignore this, think, oh, it's just a silver base, Jamar Chase, but give it 15 years down the road, and if he's breaking some records, you're going to wish you had a second year Jamar Chase silver. This car looks fire. Well, I'm pretty sure second year Tom Brady's or second year Randy Moss's inserts go for some money. Great Dolchik and a red hot rookies, Chris Olave with the fire in the background. There we go. But all right, guys, that's it. Nice little pack opening. I thought it would be a cool video to um, open up my two favorite products. And in my opinion, or honestly, I, I feel like a lot of people would agree these are the best two products of the year. So we opened them up and, you know, just, just kind of showing off how they look. And, um, yeah, hopefully this inspires you guys to uh, go out there and rip some packs. But thank you guys for stopping by, and I'll see you guys for the next video. Peace.